Homeless Solutions Incorporated is building 10 affordable apartments in Washington Township, Morris County, New Jersey. After years in the design and approvals process, the project is poised to be the first nonprofit affordable housing development in New Jersey to receive LEED Platinum certification. We are here at Jager Home Concepts in Bernardsville, New Jersey. We'll be learning more today about the windows and siding that we're using at our Drakestown Road apartments. Jager Lumber is a family owned and operated lumber business serving the entire state of New Jersey. It's been a great relationship uh, between Jager Lumber and Homeless Solutions, especially in the sense of our ability to leverage our relationships with our manufacturers, to leverage quantity and volume of orders for deeper discounts, to pass on those discounts to Homeless Solutions as a nonprofit organization. Homeless Solutions was looking for a energy efficient, green oriented product line, specifically windows. We assisted Homeless Solutions by identifying Marvin Integrity products as the correct quality and price point item to be used in their construction projects. That has since parlayed into Homeless Solutions wanting us to find other products that they might be able to use that are green in nature, are of good quality, and at a good price point. Alan, as you know at Homeless Solutions, we're very much concerned with the energy efficiency of the window and how that will impact on not only our occupants, but our uh, heating and air conditioning bills. Could you explain just a little more about um, the uh, energy efficiency features of the window? Sure. I have a sample piece right here, Ray. Uh, in particular, this is a cutaway of the Marvin Integrity All Ultrex window that's been used, actually the one that has been used on the Drakestown project. The windows we're installing are fiberglass windows. That's the key thing about them. Fiberglass is by far the superior product. It's superior in the sense that you never have to paint it. Maintenance free, it doesn't have the problems that wood inherently have, and it's just, just as strong as wood. Here we have a two pieces of glass that are double insulated. This is called the double insulated piece of glass with a low E2 with argon. Surface number two has a slight coating of silver and that helps reflect the unwanted UV rays that we don't want to come into a building and allows the natural sunlight that we do want to come into the building. So it has good quality as far as solar heat gain, as far as thermal efficiencies. The second thing that's uh, making this an energy efficient window, besides the fiberglass, besides the low E2 coating on the glass, a dense odorless gas is pumped between these two pieces of glass. So essentially, this is a gas that is uh, an inert gas that's actually sealed between this, this, these two panes of glass. And this whole unit is sealed. And, and, sealed and, completely, sealed okay. completely. And helps us keep down our electric, uh, uh, our heating bills and our, our air conditioning. Bills. Correct. Well, the installation is just typical like any other window. It has a fin on it, and that fin goes up against the ICF blocking, and that gets screwed right into it. And then once that window is installed in, uh, from the inside it gets some expansion foam that will keep any uh, air infiltrating through it. The other important thing is flashing. Uh, flashing is an integral part that has to be taken care of and there's a sequence upon which you put it in. First you put a, a, a pan flashing on the bottom, then you install the window, then you put your vertical flashing and then your horizontal flashing. It's uh, extremely sticky. It keeps the water from penetrating behind the window. After that, the siding starts to go into place. The siding we're using is a cementous type uh, siding. Could you explain to us, please, um, the benefits that we're deriving out of the uh, hardy plank uh, siding that we're using on uh, just about all of our projects? Sure, Ray. Hardy plank siding uh, consists of basically fiber cement. Okay, the organic compounds used to make this product uh, consist of cement, sand, water, and fiberglass. Uh, it's a durable product. It's a thermal barrier that will work well with the integrity window on the outside, therefore helping to achieve that lead accreditation that we're doing on the Drakestown project. Hardy Plank offers what's known as a technology called Hardy Zone, and it's basically a climate-specific coating that's applied to the hardy plank itself that helps maintain the structural integrity and the durability of the product. The cement siding is certainly sustainable. It's a cement-based product. Uh, once again, it's something that you don't have any rot, mold, or mildew. The fiber cement quality of the hardy plank is basically an excellent barrier against wood rot, 
and insect damage, and is more recyclable at the end of its useful life. This video series was made possible by the 2009 Neighborhood Builder Award from Bank of America.